Not yet. He's just a baby. Strangers disturb him. <laughs> Ooh, don't let him see Stig. He'll be disturbed for life. <laughs> yeah, let's try. Later, when he's relaxed. Is it a rabbit? No. A guinea pig, right? Or a parrot. No. Spike's a little more exotic than that. When I saw him at the pet store, I fell in love with him. And he gave me an idea for a story. There are thousands of different animals on Earth. Most we know, but a lot are still a mystery. Yeah, like Spike. No. I'm talking about animals that live in the deepest oceans or in unexplored jungles. We don't know much about them because they have no contact with humans and they live by a set of rules we know nothing about. So imagine. If one of these animals was brought into our world, would it adjust to us? Or would it play by its own rules? The rules of a game we have no chance of winning. Submitted for the approval of the Midnight Society, I call this story... The Tale of the Chameleons. Thanks. I'll stick with my fish. Hey! Don't bug the animals. What is that? Ew! I don't know. Its Latin name is Camellio Maleficus Africanus. Malico. What? It's a chameleon. Ugly little thing. It's not ugly. This one does something special. It changes colors and stuff, right? And stuff. I wanna touch it. Don't. It's probably got rabies. Reptiles don't get rabies. It's so ugly, it's cute. Ow! That little snake bit me! <laughs> One spiked you twice, and the water pay the price. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. What a strange kid. He knew it was gonna bite you. A little creep. to die. How many times do we have to go through this? I'm not letting you put blue streaks in your hair. Why not? You dyed your hair. It's not the same thing, and you know it. Mom, would you please stop treating me like a little girl? I will as soon as you stop acting like one. Weekend. Uh, no sweat. Janice can't live without you. 
Don't pick. We're eating soon. There's a big sale at the Flower Depot tomorrow. I want to pick up some delphinium spray out front. Perfect. Then we can pick up my dress on the way home. You're not getting that dress. Mom. What dress? I found the perfect dress for the spring dance. It is a tight little mini thing, and no daughter of mine is going to be seen in it. I can do what I want. Don't talk to me like that, young lady, and no, you cannot do what you want. Not yet, anyway. <gasps> How did that happen? Dad, talk to her, please. I'm sorry, babe. I got to go along with your mom on this one. I can't believe it. <sighs> now... Can we have a nice, quiet, problem-free weekend? No, we can't. It's never going to be problem-free until you let me grow up. <sighs> I'm going to take all my savings and buy the dress myself. They're going to be ticked. They're not gonna know. I'll sneak out wearing something stupid they'll prove of and I'll change at school. Is it really worth sneaking around like that? You don't know what it's like. Your parents give you all kinds of freedom. That's because my parents are never home. They're always working. Well, at least they trust you. Mine still think I need babysitting. Ow! What happened? I'm sorry. It's my finger. Throbbing because of that fight. That doesn't sound too good. It's late, and your girl should be in bed. Great. Now we've got bed check. It's okay. I'm tired anyway. Good night, Chad. Good night. Good night, Mrs. Robinson. Good night, sweetie. Begin. Fight you once, fight you twice. A little water, pay the price. What's the matter? Who are you talking to? Look. What? It was the chameleon from the store. It bit me again. Chameleon? How did it get here? I don't know. Bite you once, bite you twice, a little water, pay the price. What are you talking about? That's what the kids said, and that's what the chameleon said. The chameleon talked? It turned into me. It looked just like me. It was me. Sharon, I think the chameleon wants to be me. Jen, nothing's here. I think you were just dreaming. I wasn't. It was real. It bit me twice, and now it's coming after me with water. Tell you what, how about if I sleep in here tonight? I don't know what's going on, Sharon. I'm sorry, I... It's okay. In the morning, this will all be a bad dream, okay? What? What? 
It wasn't a dream. I'm turning into a chameleon. Look! Ugh, gross. But it's just a rash. You're not turning into a chameleon. Then why did it come after me? Janice, get a grip. It was a dream. I'm getting dressed. Sharon, do you really think it was a dream? No. I think you're being stalked by an evil chameleon that wants to take over your life. <gasps> Stay away from the water. It's the last step. <laughs> I'll see you downstairs. Don't be an idiot. I'm going to enjoy your life. Ooh, I'm learning very fast. for you. Okay, Mom. Sorry. Couldn't wait. And did you show your mom the rash? What rash? Oh, I thought I had something, but it's gone now. Well, we'll keep an eye on it. You know, Mom, I think you were right. About what? Well, dyeing my hair blue is dumb. And I don't think I'm ready to wear a dress like that. It's a little too old for me. Great. Why the change of heart? Well, I decided it wasn't worth fighting over something so dumb. Are you feeling OK? Sure. I'll call the dress shop right now and have them take it off hold. I told you it was just a phase. You know, you guys should get going. You know how crazy it gets at the flower depot. We'll clean up. Hello? Yes, no problem. I'd like to place an order. Yes, I'll hold. Thank you. It won't be long. See you in a bit. Want to help me? Sure. What's going on? Nothing. Uh, I did what you said. I got some sleep and everything before that seems like it was a bad dream. But that's all changed now. You bought the dress after all, didn't you? No, I didn't. Oh, um, don't forget to put a trap in the kitchen. Well, then what is it? Nothing!
look there. Oh, hi. 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 That was quick. Are you kidding? We practically bought out the whole store. And we bought something for you, too. Mm. What is it? Well, it's sort of an apology. We were both wrong, and I know it's not the dress you wanted, but I hope you like it anyway. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, thank you, Mom. I like it better than the other one. What were you doing? I, uh... I went to get my hairbrush. Uh, why don't you go try on the dress? We're gonna make some power drugs. Come on, ladies. Mrs. Robinson? Don't you think Janice has been acting a little... Ta-da! Wow! You look fantastic! It's perfect. What do you think, Sharon? Is it me? Uh, yeah. Hey, let's get platinum. Feeling really creative. Oh, joy. a little pale. No, I'm fine. You've been acting strange all day. Me? No, I'm fine. Having a good weekend? Good juice, huh? Oh, there's something I want to show you upstairs. What is it? It's a surprise. Come on, let's go. Ow! You're not Janice. Who are you? It's me. I'm Janice. Don't you recognize me? There's nothing you can do. There's thousands of us out here, and more of us are changing every day. Go ahead and tell them. They'll think you're crazy. Hey, Janice. Come here for a second. Please, we have a dispute here. You too, Sharon. I'll be right out, Mr. Robinson. I just have to change my shirt. So, what do you think? Um, I think they're perfect. Wait a second, hold on. You haven't even heard my idea yet. I think the trim needs to be a little thicker. It doesn't. It'll fill in. I'll be right back. Stop! I won't let you hurt my family. You're gonna get caught! You think so? I think people are so dumb they won't find out till it's too late. Don't hide it, Sharon. Just put your hand in there and get it over with. Ow! Bite you once, bite you twice. You should have counted your family at a guest. Right, grab the hose! It's me, 
Sharon. No, it's me. I'm your best friend. I'm the one who knows your parents, Bob and Carol. That's right. And they're in Hawaii. Janice! I don't know which one is you. Don't spray me. I might turn back into the chameleon. Wait, I can prove that I'm the real Janice. Only the real Janice would do this. No, it's a trick! It's really me, Sharon. Hello, oh, water. Pay the price. <laughs> Creepy dress. Welcome back, Jen. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry I had to do that, but I knew you'd find the bucket. See, we left our little friend down there. I hope she knows how to swim. <laughs> the end. That's great. Cool. So we're gonna see Spike? He's a chameleon, right? Come over and see. Oh, how cute. He's sleeping. Aren't you afraid it's gonna bite? Nah. Chameleons don't bite. <laughs> Gotta go! Oh, 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 oh. Just wait till they see you when you grow up. 